Hey, y'all. Look at listen to this. Mm. I feel like a cable show is starting. <laughs> That's oh, a wide range yeah. of possible things. <laughs> yeah. Man. This is a vampire show. Oh, what are those vampires doing? Are you just referring to True Blood? Oh, they kissing each other? Definitely. No. This has got to be True Blood. No. 14 women, one man. But you want to know something crazy? That show is not on TV right now. Uh -huh, and uh -huh. uh, Interview with the Vampire is. That's a good point. It was also set in New Orleans. I was so hyped for some Interview with the Vampire, and I saw it was a series, and I went womp Yo, womp. Dude, real talk. Mm -hmm. No bullshit. That show is awesome. All right. All right. Fair enough. Um, but and I remember tuning into True Blood back in the day. Because I remember seeing the trailer before it came out. And I was like, oh, this seems like oh, fuck. it's going to really deal with like uh, the prejudice against the vampires. Yeah. Like they're like everyone knows they're here. And like they're, True Blood. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I thought it was going to be. And then I tuned in for True Blood like episodes back in the day. I'm like, oh, that's not what it is. And I got real disappointed. Oh. Yeah. Kind of like that. That's what I sounded like. Oh. Oh, no. I just got tricked like a hundred times in a row. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Oh. All right. First of all, how the fuck do I get these to go? That's a good cursed. This is what it felt like playing Crash Bandicoot 1 for PlayStation 1. Oh, well, there they are. I was really worried that I, like, just really bodied myself. No! Oh, the jumps. All right, whatever. Yeah, brother. Oh, and I forgot that this is a bonus, so I don't need to feel bad about myself. Okay. <laughs> Do you want me to just put the words bonus at the top of the screen for this whole playthrough? Bonus. No. Mm, that's okay. Oh. Oh. All right. We I'm sound like uh, Trey and Matt in basketball. <laughs> Dude. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh. Dude, I haven't watched basketball in so long. Please watch it and tell me if I'm crazy or if those guys are actually like saying like doing that a lot in the film oh they're going oh 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 like they're disgusted or like that's a bit in the movie kind of that's what it feels like like there, there's these they're these guys that do the ah bit all the time you say the ah bit i mean you know i mean what do we what do, what do i call it at this point it's only barely i just like oh, you know what shit. it comes across as it comes across as like Why something did that they up? did yeah. In their lives at the time, and like, it just bled into their performances. Like an inside joke from the writer's room that just, like, happened? I'm not even sure if it was conscious, like, a joke. It feels like something that they actually do in real life, and because they were, like, performing in the movie, like, yeah. that's just what came out. Vibes. Let me know. What's up with them going, aw, a lot in basketball? That's going to be one of those movies that I thought was, like, so, so adult. And then I go back now, and it's like scary movie vibes. <laughs> sure. Like basically a cartoon. All I right. guess it depends on what you refer to as adult, right? Yeah, I mean, I just remember like when I was a kid, the apex of like what my parents didn't want me to see was like, ah, there's, there it is. there's something about Mary. So not so much adult as it is like contraband. Yeah, like, yeah, exactly. Gotcha. Basketball has like some penis jokes in it, you know? I, I'll say, yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm trying to think of like the epitome of what my parents would let me watch. I don't know. Uh, Care Bears. Oh, that's right. My parents hated the Care Bear. Uh, I don't know, man. They kind of let me watch whatever the fuck I wanted as long as it wasn't like hardcore porn or something. You know? My mom was weird. Like she was like, King of the Hill? Good. Simpsons? No. That is very strange. That was my mom. Really? Yeah. Oh, I probably know why. You ready? By the time King of the Hill premiered, the controversy about like semi adult cartoons had kind of worn off. The panic about Bart Simpson and his like negative influence on the youth was already dying down, I think, and there was no such kind of character. Yeah, in Bobby's the King not of the like Hill. a bad kid. Right. And I think even if he were, I think at that point, like that ship had sailed and no one was really panicking about misbehaved cartoon children anymore. Yeah, that's true. Like when you think about it, when did King of the Hill premiere? Like fucking. 1996, seven, right? I almost would guess later, but maybe not. I could be wrong, yeah. And uh, that's a completely different world animation-wise from 1989 or whatever. Yeah, and Mike Judge is, like, not really, like... Well, I guess he is. I guess he was, like, the original in a way. Like, show that kids shouldn't be watching that looks like it's for kids kind of vibes. 
Oh, yeah, he was one of those ones, absolutely. I realize now that he's like the original, but I don't think of him as that because he doesn't really go for the cheap laughs in the same way. My mom told me a co-worker convinced her that it was okay for me to watch it. The Simpsons or King of the Hill? King of the Hill. That's... Look, man, I'm never going to sit here and judge your mom. Hi, Ted's mom. We love you around these parts. I'm never going to do that, but and I'm never going to, like, fully talk out of the side of my neck because I don't have kids. That being said, I'd like to think that if I had a kid, I was worried about potentially what he was consuming, and I would be. Uh, I certainly wouldn't go to my coworker. I would probably just try and, like, see what the fuck they're into and watch it for myself. That shit's cuckoo bananas to me to put my fucking faith in Monica from HR. My <laughs> my uh, thing, if I had kids, or if I had to choose what kids watched, I would just be like, nothing algorithm driven, nothing AI made. Mm. Like art only. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like stuff that was made with a take only. Mm. Which I think is like kind of where my mom's head was at in a like in a way with like the Care Bears thing. Hmm. What is this? He's like, well. Also, what's what is he? Armadillo? Ah, uh, yeah. I think so. Yo, this guy's cooking up some good shit. You know he is. All right. Good luck, Sam. I can't believe that happened. I can't believe that occurred. That's pretty good. It's like it's funny because it's like not really like a very action-packed part. Aw, aw. I can't believe this is happening. I'm gonna put the word bonus up there. We'll feel all good about it, dude. Ted, put the word bonus. Just up Just throw there, the please. bonus up there, please, for the audience, so that they don't know that I'm failing. They think this is optional. There you go. Good shit. Good shit. They're like, let's make it hard for, for him to jump where he can't see the little yellow circle as well. That's what that double jump is for. Like, every time that I've yeah. died, I thought I wasn't going to die. You know what I mean? Hmm. Okay. <gasps> oh, no! Crash! <laughs> Turns out you can't spin to break those bots. Being being like really worried about the well-being of your video game avatar is like very funny to me. Like you think they're real. Like you and him are like getting through this. Knuckles, no! Oh no. I don't want anybody to have to watch me do this. Uh, <laughs> I, w I wanna I wanna just let's do a supercut of all of the times where I just do it perfect. If you did it perfect, wouldn't it only be once? Like the whole, like just like a like an endless, unbroken, perfect run of Crash Bandicoot Four with no deaths. Mm. That's what the people want. Come on! I don't want to die again, please. He's got the fucking Pokemon Pokemon branded lunchbox down there next to his like boo boo sandwich, whatever he's got. I want to see it. I didn't see it before. Did him, uh, see down that blue thing? Yeah. Okay, check it out. All right. Oh, I see. Fuck uh, it! Ah! 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 Oh! 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 No! How do I jump? Hey! There you go. Yo, my man is sliding. No! I'm not a fan. It's of okay. This. It's bonus. I'm not a fan of this bonus it's level. It's bonus. I'm not a fan of this bonus stage. Did you hear him laugh at me? Did you hear him laugh at my self-confidence? <laughs> They're all gonna laugh at you! The swamp animals <laughs> are looking at my clown no! show and laughing! They're all gonna laugh at you! That's what the mask is saying to me. Is that what it is? Is Aku Aku just like uh, anxiety? Is that what you guys with like crippling social anxiety? Is that what it feels like? Is it this Aku? Ah, ah. But Aku's there to like protect you. I'll tell you what it feels like. It feels like when you have crippling social anxiety, uh -huh. it's like a checklist of things that you worry about all the time and you just keep checking the list. So no, it doesn't feel like the mask? Okay. I mean, unless him coming around to the front and like yelling at you is the list, you know what I'm saying? Here's the thing, the Aku actually does protect you from harm, whereas like that for those little voices 
I don't know. I think that they're mostly detrimental, you know? I believe that anxiety is your body mm. trying to prevent you from harm. Right, like it's trying to help, but in actuality, yeah, probably not doing any good, probably more harm. If we didn't live in a society and we just had to, like, worry about sitting on the branch and not falling off, uh, anxiety wouldn't exist. All right. You ever think about that? I don't know, man. I, I'm pretty sure that before society, human beings were still pretty fucking anxious all the time. Hell no. No? Okay. Not at all. They felt they felt great. Yeah, studies show. Studies the, the studies show. Before we had to have houses, life human was beings sweet. were like, "This is dope. I love having to like Why? hunt for Why? my food all the Why? time." Why? Why? This is humiliating. Why does this guy want me to do this? I've never met this guy. That's true. He just showed up. Who is he? And it, it that What's looks so like funny? Dingle Dial on his like. Does he work for Dingle Dial? I don't know. Is that him? It's definitely not Dingo Dial. Like, is it like, is this like this, like maybe that's just the Dingo? Oh, I see. So that's not Dingo Dial on his picture. That's Dingo just, Dial timeline. What? Like, wh wh huh? like, so Dingo Dial, maybe there's a, di a Dingo and a Crocodile, and then Dingo Dial timeline is when they like get mushed, mushed up. You're saying Dingo Dial is an anomaly. Yeah. I, I think see. he is. I think that's the whole point of the Dingo Dial. Oh, fuck my shit. Oh. No bro. worries. Everything's fine. So they just stop being bouncy, huh? Once the counter's going, they're not bouncy anymore. Correct. That's the trick. No. Ooh. Ooh. God Ooh. damn it. Ooh. They're like, hey, look how janky our jump mechanics are. Can you deal with this? Ooh, get them. Now we're getting into it. Are we criticizing the jump mechanics? I just think this part is particularly shitty at the end. Mm. Like, I don't like how it, it doesn't feel mm -hmm. good. Mm. What happened there? See that? Did he run over something? You heard you bullshitting. Hey, you shitty, shitty armadillo. What do you know? Every game is perfect. It's just me that's a problem. Mm. I should keep it to myself. Mm. Even though I'm an expert. That's right, I forgot about that part. Okay. Wait, is that even this series? Where I'm the expert? I think it is. I don't think it's this series. <laughs> Where I'm pretending to be a video game expert? Right. No! This part sucks so much. This part actually sucks so much. If you want, I can give you tips. It's your call. <sighs> Let's see if I can just... I can't. I don't have time. Take it. Hey. I'll take it. I don't care. Oh wait, are we still? Oh no, no, no. He's done. He's done. Don't he, you dare. He's like, thank you. Don't you dare. Where? Who are you? Why? Why did I do this? Is this back country over here? Is this like a block? Is, is it like I gotta break that? Yep. Here we go. Okay. Skateboat. Yo, you are moving, Whoa. bro. I did not do that. Were you just, using the boost that whole time? No, it's like downhill goes faster for some reason. It's like physics I think it's called gravity. Something, some kind of physics. <laughs> Something's making me go faster some downhill. Kind of physics situation. Also, right. I was evoking Shatner. Yeah, some kind of spa. Something's making me go faster. Question of the day: Who's the Spock? Who's the Kirk? And who's the McCoy of the Beard Bros? You're Spock. Gerard's Kirk. I'm McCoy. That's just knee jerk. I don't know, man. That's just knee jerk. That's just know. knee jerk. I don't know. I'll take Spock. That's knee jerk. I didn't but think about. I don't about know. It. McCoy is like it. a bit sardonic. Uh, he's kind of um, jaded. I wouldn't use the word jaded. Maybe a little bit, but it's more that like, because him and Spock are always diametrically opposed at one another. Yeah, he's like he's like literally like I'm human emotion, and Spock yeah. is like the mastery of emotion. Like he 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 does feel emotion a lot. Yeah, and he, and <laughs> Bones is also like a lot of the time. Oh, who the fuck is that? Who is Yo, that? Cracked out crash. What's going on? What is that? <laughs> is that an inside joke that I don't know about? I think so. Yeah. What the who the fuck was that guy? Ah! I was cracked out. That fucked me up. That was like Kevin Roberts. That what was hell you was from that? if you had done meth one time. Oh shit. I was like near near. I was like doing like a little fucking 
He was voguing. Madonna Vogue dance? Yeah. yeah. This section is tight. It's... I really am, like, wishing I could jump. I, like, keep thinking I can jump. Seems like he should be able to, because I feel like if anybody wants to do an ollie, it's Crash Bandicoot, but... Whoa, what the hell was that? Oh, that was just apples flying into my ass. Oh, shit! No, what?! I didn't deserve to die there. I love that the music's kind of like not that exciting. Hmm. It's like kind of chill still. Okay, no boosties, okay? No boosties at this time. Oh, what a dick. Oh, what a dick. Maybe that's the problem, man. I don't I don't know if we have a Kirk. You think that's the problem? That's the problem in life, man. We don't have a Kirk. I don't care about you, you weird hobgoblin. But we really do. I, I want to know. How the fuck am I supposed to do that? No boosties. Here we go. Oh, wow. He got them all. I'm just going to imagine that the game just, like, is perfect. What do you mean? Like... I'm just gonna, like, imagine that what I'm doing is the right thing every time. Okay. Isn't that what you've already been doing? I've been trying to, like, control it better, and and I'm just now just not gonna, like, guess. I'm just gonna be like, if I press this direction, that's the that's gonna work. Okay. You're nailing it so far. I don't like that guy. All right. It seems like you've just stopped holding forward, which, yeah, gives you a lot more control. Dude. Holy fucking shit. All right. Oh, yeah. No. Yes. What was the... No. No. What was the no about? I didn't want to not hit that. I thought I was going to fly off the, the skate boat. Mm. Dude. I crushed that. Yeah, you did excellent. Yeah, you, you know what's up, Crash, you little bastard. Uh, time to get uh. out. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What time is it? Crash, Coco, come on, oh. give old Capuna. Coco! Oh, oh. <laughs> ah! Aww. Does she, is she able to like suck? How does she kiss? She has like a hole. I see everything. Oh. I'm time? Holy shit. Is that why my sister looks like her desiccated corpse? <laughs> Your very near future. Shocking events that will change the course of your life. Yeah, I'm just gonna stop you there before you tell us how we all die. Oh, that's the anxiety mask right there. That's actually the real. Giant mask -eating monster from beyond the stars. Leaving that is your choice. What? <laughs> mask eating monster? Fucking Irene Adler over here. Irene Adler. Right then. Need a hand. Hey, there's that fucking armadillo. Oh, is this my fate, Snow World? What if it's like very, very gently and like specifically based off the thing? <laughs> is this Crash a new is like pointing at his sister. Oh! Is this a stage? Hold on. Yeah, it's a Dingo Dow stage, if you want it. Does that mean it's not a regular stage? Well, it's a Dingo Dow stage. Like, is it optional? Yes. Oh. No Dingo Dowling, mate. I'm from Louisiana. Jesus. Louisiana. Oh, there's your boy. Jet boat. That's more like it. Nah. Which way he said, I am. No, I am. What? Oh, what? Was that a Deadpool reference? Oh, what? Oh, that's uh, some video game. Yeah, it's Mortal Kombat 2, the Deadpool. Deadpool? Oh, yeah, you're right. Damn. How you know the name of shit? Come on, bro. That's like <laughs> Mortal Kombat. I was there. I was there too, but I'm like, huh, oh, wah. But you're like, ah. Oh. <laughs> Look, that's a very specific sound from my childhood. You're right, you're right. Oh, wah. Well. Do you not know, do you know the name of any stage from Mortal Kombat? The big man, the mean trees. <laughs> mean, mean. The big man, comma. <laughs> 
The big man from trees. It's like a David Lynch episode. Oh. It, oh! Do you not know the name of that level? The Wispy Woods. The Whispering Woods. Do you know the name of any level from Mortal Kombat ever? The like, Pit. There you go. Good job. You nailed it. Shao Kahn's uh -huh. realm. Shao, <laughs> Shao Kahn's Shao Kahn's man cave. Shao Kahn's <laughs> zone. Shao Kahn zone act two. <laughs> Shao Kahn's area round two. I would hate that. Shao Kahn's area. Ah! <laughs> did I tell you about all about Motaro? Did I tell you about that? Motaro? Yeah, did I tell you that? Did I tell you about, quote, all about Motaro? No, no. I remember... First of all, Motaro, for those of you who might not know, is like a weird centaur zebra deer. Oh, he's a centaur. Yeah. From Mortal Kombat. From Mortal Kombat 3 specifically. Yeah. So this must have been around when that game was out. And, you know, me, I'm constantly reading in, like, the game pros and the manuals of the games, learning as much about these characters. What most would call uh, lore today. Yeah. Because uh, I love that shit. It was my favorite game franchise, period. Mortal time. Kombat? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I think my cousin was over. And I was, you know, telling him about this shit. Maybe we were playing the game. Maybe we weren't. But I remember at a certain point, I'm, like, gushing about Motaro. And then he goes, like, where did you learn all this stuff? Do you have, like, a book, like, all about Motaro? <laughs> and, like, I pictured that little book. It was about like the size of a pamphlet. You know what I mean? Like a like a scholastic bookstore book about Kinda. Montaro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With him on the cover, that classic uh, artwork, the key art. Uh, and I never forgot about all about Montaro. What in the fuck am I supposed to do right here? No show. Maybe grab. Yeah. Oh, whoopsie doopsie daisies. What the fuck? Oh hell yeah. Got that explosion AOE ricochet. Pew. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god. Oh, oh you my don't god. Wait. You don't want to wait for that one, huh? Oh, oh, oh man. This, this guy is such a loser. He doesn't know how to drive his shitty boat. You really don't like that armadillo. I really don't like the boat. The boat actually sucks. All right, hold on. Now you're insulting his driving ability and shit. He just, like, what the fuck? Okay, like, he waits for the one, but he drives right under another green one. Mm, it just doesn't make wait, fucking sense. Who is this guy? Oh, boy. So I can't double jump with this, or else he just throws it. Correct. All right, bruv. Nice. Oh, you sick bitch. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. My god, his ass. Nice he job. ain't shit! Stagnant water. Smells like <laughs> but I die if I touch it! <laughs> it's true. You know how you refer to things that kill you as your home? You don't? Well, that must be a dingo dial thing. I'm unique. Ah! Where did we all get our bad Australian accents from? I think from uh -huh. that movie with the eagle. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you mean? The rescuers? The rescuers down under. Down under. What was his name? Marahute? Marahute? Is that real? Is that his name? That sounds yeah, like something I would say when I ask somebody if they want to smoke weed with me. Marahute? Hey, you want a Marahute? Uh, can you double check on that for me, please, Ted? What was the name? Acknowledged. Of the eagle and... In... No, Ted, you don't have to do the robot oh, voice anymore. Oh, shit. You booted up the 386 <laughs> version of the Ted decks. Well, how did I do that? I don't know. It's Windows 2.3. Oh, dude. the worst timeline! Yeah. <laughs> because now you have to do it again. Yeah. Isn't this fucking stupid? The worst timeline. Well, you I, did it once. You can do it again. Yeah. It's fine. Yeah. I just loved it so much the first time that it's fun to come back and do it again. 
I'm sensing some sarcasm. They were like, I bet you this guy's going to love this part. And it's different box arrangement. Yeah, definitely different. So, like, I can't know. It's like, I can't see the future. No, god damn it. I don't care. I don't care. I just want to beat it. Yeah. Good luck. Are you still checking on that, Ted? Yeah. I'm going to look it up real quick, okay? No. Ah, oh, now it's a sense of pride. Ugh. I looked up the characters and I don't see the. You're asking about Just this. Just Google Rescue is down under Eagle. Oh, Eagle. What the fuck did you hear us say? I thought you were talking about the Australian, Australian uh, little. Mary little Hepa ma guy. The, 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 the villain? Isn't his name just. No. Yeah, what did you think we were asking you to look up? Don't they have a buddy? Rat oh. that they meet? Yes. Yes. And he's oh, like, oh, oh, the other, the other mouse. Yes. Yes. Right. Yeah. No, not him. The name of the eagle. The gold eagle. Uh, I feel like it's Marahut. Yeah, Mar there it is Marahute. Marahute. Oh. Oh, Marahute. The Marahute. <laughs> That'll be Marahute for five hundred. <laughs> That's Marahute. The Will Ferrell like. Yeah, I thought version. that's what you were doing. I was just doing the regular Alex Trebek. Oh, my bad. But that, like, specifically, you, you like, somehow captured... Because I thought you were doing the Connor. Yeah. Oh, uh, shit. Uh, I can't believe that I'm here again, and we're 30 minutes into this, and then <laughs> I'm going to go, next time on Beard Bros, I'm going to do this, and it's just the same shit again. All right. Let's do one more. God you damn. Do one more? Yeah. One more round. God damn. Do you want a tip still? Or it didn't seem like you wanted it before. What's the tip? So in that part later on where you have to like, we were bouncing on those boxes, but trying real hard to stand back on the platform so you can duck. When you land, just land with a spin. That way you won't bounce. You understand what I'm saying or no? No, I don't. Uh, when we get there, I'll try and tell you. Are you saying that I can land on boxes and not bounce on them? Yes, if you land with a spin. Because you'll break them. There it is. Okay. You saw it? Yeah, yeah. Yes! Careful about this one, though, of course. No. And that is also something that I should be doing more. <laughs> Brett, did you remember that mm -hmm. the red boxes don't uh, bounce anymore if you step on them once? I definitely remember that. Doesn't really make sense, though, does it? All right, hold on. No, it, it does. Boxes <laughs> only got one bounce in them. Yeah, unless they're the uh, crate boxes. That further damages the logic of the idea that just by tapping on the top of the box once that it should no longer be able to. Are we really talking about the internal logic of how these boxes work? I got that, and I got a problem about how nice this guy's little skiff looks for how few customers he seems to have. I don't know, man. There's a lot. Look at all those houses. Where are the fucking ones buying the fucking gumbo at? Uh, those bats, probably. Those bats don't buy shit. They don't got money. You know those bats ain't got no money. Jesus. You fancy got no money. They don't live that life. They don't have a government. They're just bats. They were cones. Ugh. No. I was close. Nope. Okay. Oh. So janky. All right. Here we go. Climbing up those steps to get on that is like really weird collision. Every time that I try and do it, I like run into like an invisible post. All right, mm -hmm. here we go. This is the last try. Ever. <laughs> Either win or lose. The series might end right here. All right, Crash, you son of a bench. You son of a bandicoot, probably. Purebred Bandicoot. At least he's not a half breed like Dingo Doll. He's not a Bandicoot either. He's a loser. There you go. That was clean. No! God, why? It's bonus. It's bonus. Why? Why? Okay. Every other box that you jump on, as long as it's present, you bounce on it. 
Whatever. No one cares. Look at these gators. I'm what are they up to? Trying to get them bats, probably. That's a whole That's circle all about life. these bats. These bats. They're fat. Like you They're think fine. they have? They, you, they live in those big ass houses? I, I mean, I'm not sure on that, but somebody does. Somebody does. What if they're like, no, I don't know what those are. They're <laughs> naturally occurring. It's like a biome in Minecraft. They just show up. <laughs> Look forward to the Beard Bros Minecraft. No! No! God! Do you want another tip? Just give the controller to somebody who knows how to play Crash Bandicoot? How did you know? What is the, what is the, what is the tip? When the hold, try and hold uh, the jump button, the first time you jump off of these TNT boxes, you get extra height. That's kind of dangerous too, though, because if mm -hmm. the, the, my problem is that I'm, I'm getting a little too much air time sometimes also. Okay, well. I have to like know which one it's going to be before I get there. Hmm. Like, you don't have to, like, press and hold. You can, like, press, see that it's TNT, and then start holding. Like, press it again if you want. There you go. If you want, you know, for the later section where you're trying to clear these nitros is what I'm saying. Yeah. There you go. Right now, you can just do it. There you go. And then spin or not. Yeah. Fuck that. No risks. Mm-hmm. <gasps> no. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it all. You did Fuck it. Fuck it all. Fuck it all. All right. Good luck, sir. Where? Where? Where are you headed? Oh, did you just barf? You, you see that? Gross. I hate the smell of bandicoots. You were playing with fire, brother. Nah. Quite literally. Nah. Nah. Aw. Nah. Aw. Skateboat. I wonder how this one's going to be different. The answer is, in no way! Oh no, yeah, lots more boxes. Way more difficult. Wish I could jump. I wish I could jump over that. Like, that turn is so... Why? Wait, why did that happen? Alright. Okay, don't use the D-pad for this, is the truth. Believe I use the D-pad for pretty much everything in this game, but... You just can't drive the boat, because if you touch anything else, it fucks up your, like, circle. Hmm. Like, if you accidentally touch one of the other buttons on the D-pad, it, like, fucks your shit up. Okay. No! No! God damn it! They're so pretty. It's like the tank control element of the boat, like, if it crosses, like, the whatever 45-degree line, it, like, starts to, like, turn you the other direction or something. Look, see that? Fuck. That. Alright. You have a lot of lives. Yeah, I'm not worried about it. Like, we've never... We've never really dropped below where we were when we started a level. Like, by the time we beat the boss, we have, like, more lives. Okay. Okay. I'm literally, like, so focused. And I, like, still don't feel 100% confident. Neither does Crash. Why did that one not... <gasps> no! That one was the trick. That's so fucked up. All right. Whoa! This game is full of hatred for me, the player. They're like, ha <laughs> But you didn't notice that, you piece of shit. <laughs> they did. They sent me a letter. They, they said... Like, we got you, you dumb bitch. They sent bitch. a picture of them, like, pointing at the camera and laughing. It's like me on like a on like a, a red light camera, but I'm like playing Crash. Mm. All right. I know if I were a video game developer, I would just like try and make things to make fun of my player. You know, it's it's a really joyous <gasps> thing to do sometimes. Fuck with people. Yeah. But this feels cruel and unusual. All right. There you go. Like, fuck. Mm. Like, fuck. Is 
the Saturday morning cartoon music. ABC Family. This is like so specific, but it sounds like some kind of like if you like got like a Crash Bandicoot like educational tie-in inside of a cereal box. That made music? And yeah, you like put the diskette in and it's like Crash Counting or some shit like that. Oh, like a CD-ROM? Yeah, like a, bre gotcha. like a breakfast CD-ROM. Gotcha. I thought you meant a toy that like made this amount of music. I'd be like, that'd be crazy. No, 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 no. Yeah, like a like a like a diskette. Okay, okay, no boosting at all. Like hey. I hit that. I hit that. You did hit it. Like that's all good. I still have no idea how I was supposed to Oh my god, what if I died right there? Somehow. They're yeah. just like, throw him off the board. He's done. I have no idea how to not get hit by that. Good don't, games. Be, don't be like that, Crash. He's feeling himself. Next time on Beard Bros, it'll be a shorter episode. We'll see you guys next time. Thanks for hanging with us, y'all. Bye.